by the grace of Allah, he has bestowed upon his servants seasons of worship in which good deeds are multiplied and they complete in drawing closer to their Lord. Out of these noble seasons is the ten days of Dhul Hijjah for Allah Almighty has placed in them his favor and honor for his servants. Among these days there is the day of Tarwiyah, the day of Arafah, and the day of sacrifice. By the greatness of its importance, Allah Almighty swore by it, by saying, by the dawn and by ten, the ten nights. The Prophet, peace be upon him, inform that these are the best days in the world, saying, the best days in the world are the ten days of the Hijjah, in which righteous deeds are more beloved to Allah than any other days. Abu Uthman and Nahdi said concerning the early predecessors, they used to ma- magnify three periods of time. The last ten days of Ramadan, the first ten days of the Hijjah, and the first ten days of Muharram. So how can we prepare for these days? Ibn Abbas report, may Allah be pleased with him, reported that the Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, said, there are no days in which righteous deeds are more beloved to Allah than these ten days. The companions asked, not even jihad for the sake of Allah, he replied, not even jihad for the sake of Allah, except in the case of a man who went out risking himself and his property and did not return with anything. Doing righteous deeds includes various types of worship, such as fasting, prayers, Hajj, remembrance of Allah, reciting the Qur'an, spending in charity, and more.